We live in an environment where customer data is always at risk. A security incident occurs when intruders compromise data systems and information becomes at risk. Research on data breaches by Verizon defines an incident as one that compromises the integrity, confidentiality, or availability of data. Today, we're going to look at five of the worst cybersecurity breaches of all time. There are many ways to rank these breaches, but we chose to highlight the ones with the highest record and the highest dollar impact. Some were repeated, and perhaps even worse, some were inside jobs. Most records affected. When Yahoo admitted in 2014 that it was hacked the prior year, it didn't come clean on the extent of the breach. In fact, the search engine company was infiltrated more than once. When Verizon dug into the search engine's records during due diligence for their acquisition, they uncovered more than Yahoo cared to admit. The first report stated that 500 million accounts were affected, but further investigation found the breach impacted every existing Yahoo account. In the end, Yahoo lost customers, traffic, and ad revenue. Many longtime users walked away from the search engine and email provider for good. Greatest financial impact. To date, the costliest cybersecurity breach occurred at a company that's not a household name. Epsilon is an international email marketing company that was hit by a database hack back in 2011. Epsilon managed email campaigns for customers like Capital One, Barclays, and Citigroup, among others. And its breach was projected to enable innumerable successful phishing scams. When you include forensic audits, monitoring, litigation, and lost business, the estimated total damage was three to four billion dollars. Most repeated breaches. Yahoo makes the top cybersecurity breaches list twice because it was hit multiple times to the extent that the breaches compromised every one of its three billion customers. That represents a stunning 100% failure. Also troubling is that Yahoo's delayed notification put customers at ongoing risk. There were at least two separate breaches, one in August 2013 and the other in late 2014. Yahoo delayed notification of the latter breach until 2016 when it became public knowledge that customer data was for sale on the dark web. Biggest inside job. It's upsetting when criminals creep into a company and steal data through a back door. However, when they walk right through the front door and buy sensitive data, it's nothing short of unsettling. Such is the case with Court Ventures, which is now owned by Experian. It sold personal data to a criminal that ran an identity theft business. All it took was a credible lie and some cash. The total cost of the Court Ventures breach is unknown. What is known is that almost 14,000 consumers fell victim to an income tax fraud, totaling more than $65 million. Roughly 200 million consumer data records were sold and accessed. Most egregious. The breach at the Office of Personnel Management made this list because it so brazenly targeted the U.S. government. The highly coordinated and heavily funded breach began with a hack at a government contractor where credentials were stolen to facilitate the attack. The court dismissed a class action suit filed on behalf of federal employees because the plaintiffs failed to prove legally actionable harm. A team worked around the clock to ferret out and destroy the malware that nested on 10 machines, including an admin server. Hackers had access to millions of background checks, employee files, and even digital fingerprint archives. What's frightening about this breach is that investigators don't know where the data went or who has it now. These are some of the biggest hacks of all time but even a minor security breach can devastate a business reputation and future. If you're not prepared with an incident response plan, you're at risk. Start a conversation with us today and see how we can help you protect your company's data. Visit our site to learn more. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.